Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to see what your Android emojis look like when you send them to an iPhone user. Now, as Android users, we're obviously better than those yucky iOS people, but unfortunately we have to communicate with them from time to time. And if you like to use emojis in your text messages, you've probably noticed by now that the smileys you send out aren't the same smileys that your recipient sees if they're using an iPhone. If you're not careful though, this can lead to an awkward breakdown in communication. Maybe you thought you picked out the perfect emoji to suit your sentiment, but its iOS counterpart doesn't quite convey the same message. So developer Paul Holinsky created a nifty little app that'll let you see exactly what your outgoing emojis will look like when you send them to an iPhone user. The app is called Emojily, and it's available on the Google Play Store for free. So search it by name to get it installed, then we'll see what it's all about. Now it's a pretty simple interface. You basically just use this text input field to see what your emojis would look like on iOS. And on this Galaxy S5 here, the stock keyboard has an emoji button regardless of what app you're using it with. But for other keyboards, that may not be true. So depending on if you're using Swipe, SwiftKey, or another keyboard, you may not be able to enter your emojis directly into this field. But that's no biggie. Just open your favorite text messaging app and type any message that contains emojis. Before you hit send, though, take a second to copy your message. Now you can just flip back over to the Emojily app and from here just paste your message into the field. So it also works as a quick way to screen your outgoing messages to see what they'll look like when you send them to the recipient. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!